Hi, I'm Stacy Stath. I thought you understood, Henry. You and I are not going to be dating. Ugh, call it whatever you want to call it. I'm talking martinis, fine dining, the moon and the stars. Just a night of delicious possibilities. I mean, you, you've got to eat, right? And you don't think that'd be sending you the wrong message? Especially the kind of night you're talking about. The moon, the stars, the gazing. Okay, you know, fine. Ignore the moon and the stars and no gazing allowed. Anything else? Why do you keep asking me out? I told you there's nothing that's going to happen between us. I gave you no encouragement. You know, Mike hasn't given you any encouragement. Have you already given up to? I didn't mean to insult you. He said yes to dinner. And why would he say yes if he didn't see anything more? And he should, because if he would just see that we were are really good... I do sound like you. <laughs> Just why don't you give me a chance, okay? You can think of it as karma. You know, if you change your mind about me, maybe Mike will change his mind about you. Besides, I've got one distinct advantage over Mike. What's that? I'm here. <laughs> okay, Coleman. You, you want to push this? We'll go there. What do you think we have even the least bit compatible? You're beautiful, and I'm deeply aware of that. And I'm a cop, and, well, you have a rap sheet, and a gambling problem, and some would say a martini problem, and your ethics are less than dubious. And the problem with all of that is... We're nothing alike! I, I know it! I love that about us! There is no talking sense into you. You're so logical. And, and I'm so not, you know, I think it's the opposite thing that really attracts me about you. And, and to be candid, the cop thing is just fascinating to me. You know, you know, I do have this fantasy that does involve handcuffs and also it doesn't, if you catch my meaning. <laughs> what do I need to do? I need to beg for you to say yes? It's just one date. That's all I'm asking. Even if I'm not even romantically attracted to you at all. I can handle it. Come on, Randy. Would it be just totally awful to spend the evening with someone who's just completely crazy about you? Not totally awful. Is that a yes? It's a date. Starting now. Waiter, two martinis, dry with olives.